The Christian Education Center Mallory was established in the year 2003 with a land measuring 32 acres donated by Mallory Village landowners through the initiative of Mallory Village Council. Christian Education Center Mallory is an educational wing of the Pottery Baptist Church Council with an aim to establish a theological and liberal art college. It envisages to theologically train and equip young men and women and prepare them for the work of the Lord. It also aims to impart holistic and quality secular higher education to young students by molding them with biblical values and principles so that they can live a life of dignity, honor, and respect, and in the fear of the Lord. With faith in God, we look forward to seeing Christian Education Center Mallory with full-fledged residential courses of both theology and liberal arts. The goal of both theological and liberal art studies is to mold young people to become ambassadors of Christ. We live in such a time when we need so many trained men and women of God to carry on God's mission so as to fulfill the great commission of our Lord Jesus Christ. God has placed our people in a very strategic point where we can reach out to many unreached people groups in mainland India and also to many Southeast Asian countries. Therefore, since its inception in 2003, Christian Education Center Mallory has been conducting leadership seminars, workshops on various subjects, short-term Bible course, and part-time two-year certificate in theology with the same purpose. Christian Education Center Mallory needs the support of individual believers, families, churches, and other organizations to prepare servants of God for the work of the Lord. Therefore, participate in the great mission of God by continuously extending your support in all possible ways to Christian Education Center Memory Ministry. With the support of believers and God's guidance, one day Christian Education Center will be a missionary training and sending center. As the Bible verse says, Romans chapter 10 verse 14 and 15, how then can they call on the one they have not believed in, and how can they believe in the one of whom they have not heard, and how can they hear without someone preaching to them, and how can they preach unless they are sent, as it is written, how beautiful are the feet of those who bring good news.